Hey guys, I'm Dennis, a fourth year bioengineer at Northeastern. So far, I've had an unforgettable four years on campus and abroad, and you're in Greece. Because of this, I wanted to take a chance to give back and make a day in the lifestyle vlog to help any prospective Northeastern students with their decision. So sit back, grab some popcorn, and enjoy my life in the wake of a global pandemic. Hey Alexa, light on. The first stop of my day is an 8 a.m. appointment to the Swole Factory. Marino, as of December 7th, 2020, has a 90 person capacity. Marino requires an app called Atleto to book for a maximum of 50 minutes, often needing three days in advance due to demand. Overall, Northeastern has done a fantastic job with the setup, disinfecting every hour, which definitely makes me feel safe using the equipment. First class of the day, 9.45, bioelectricity. Alrighty, just finished my first class. Talked about EKGs and EEGs, how they work, and we're gonna design them uh, for one of our labs, which is pretty cool. Next up, we're gonna get some lunch at the Curry Student Center. Stay tuned. Thank you. Got my second class, Sex and Communications, my elective. Here we go. Already just finished Sex and Communications. Honestly, a really good class, really interesting. So if you guys need to finish your NU path, your diversity requirement, I would recommend sex communications with Kara. Um, and now let's get COVID tested. The Cabot Testing Center, which used to be an indoor track, is where all the testing happens. Northeastern personally handles half the QPCR tests in-house and outsources the other half to the Broad Institute in Cambridge. These are the anterior swabs and not the painful deep ones. As of December 7th, 2020, Northeastern requires at least one test every three days for on-campus students and off-campus students who regularly come to campus. All right, gonna play some spike ball and then I'll be back. Peace. Alrighty, just finished some spike ball 
and uh, gonna go back to Isaac and keep grinding before my meeting. Alrighty, so I just finished up my section for the design of medical devices project, which is pretty much like we take a device um, and then go through all the regulation and paperwork to approve it with the FDA. Pretty interesting class, but now I'm headed to my meeting and going home. Did I really just put my phone on the ground and bike away? Yes. Was it worth it? You tell me. Group project time. Peace, dude. Oh, thanks, man. <laughs> Peace. And we're done. And it's dinner time. Favorite time of the day. Can you guess what is for dinner? And it wouldn't be racist if you said dumplings. Bang, boom, kapow. Some fried dumplings. You really can't go wrong. I'll let you know how it goes. And there is the final product. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope you found it informative. Found my life pretty boring. Um, and don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks guys.